Hey everybody, Martin Chuck here with uh, a pretty, what I think is a very functional at-home configuration. I've got basically two plane stations on the ground connected to each other, and they they fit together. This I've got a long stick in the back one. You'll see why in just a second. And then I've got a short stick in the 55 degree angle. And so for those of you that kind of struggle with early extension, this orange stick on my tailbone here, that's going to help with the awareness of that. And this one on my the angle by my tr by my lead knee by my sorry by my trail knee it's going to help me with the idea of how my lower body should work and how my rotation shouldn't pop into this stick and this is adjustable I can pull it out of here and if I want to make it a little bit more upright I can do so that's probably where I need to have it. it's probably 60 it'll make it a little harder so if I have any kind of behavior of my knees this way that I hit it so I've got my tailbone on the trail side I've got that awareness, this channel that my legs can kind of unwind and work within as I keep my rear end back. Let's hit a shot and we'll take a look at it. That felt pretty nice. Let's take a look. Put those up on the screen here and go through this with you guys and gals. So I've got the, let's go through these sticks I've got. I've got my trail leg awareness that's angled out there. And from the down the line view, it doesn't look like an angle. It looks like a vertical. And then I've got my rear end stick that I can feel on my tailbone, which you can't really see in the face on, but it's, oh, it's up behind me about like so, okay? And then the relationship of moving the golf club here, you know, I want to feel as though I can keep that, and you know, I'm getting a little deeper with that right glute on the back swing. And then my knees, I can unwind and keep that tush line without kind of crashing into this stick that's in front of my leg here. So as I kind of go through and hit this golf ball, let's work through this in the face on. Back swing feels little separation that knees not pushing toward the ball it's it's pushing event but there's a little bit of unweighting and then pushing forward this is when the club will come down collect the ball with a bit of forward shaft lean and then I can mosey on up into a finish there but it's really easy for me to get my knee kicking too much that way if that happens and my buns get under me too much, and I extend too much, then I lose control of the club face a little bit, and I'm prone to hitting hooks. But if I get in that position right there, that's usually a pretty pleasing club face control situation. So kind of doing this with a couple of plane stations on the ground. You can see I've got them connected down here. I've got one stick on the ground that's you know a ball location stick that is also the stability stick that holds both of the plane stations secure on the ground and you just make it a little bit bigger than your feet and that's the little station right there so it's a pretty nice awareness station for early extension just where your body has to doesn't have to but there's some generalities there that tend to be with some of the more reliable strikers anyway I hope you enjoy that video